Howdy everybody, Mr. G here. I hope you're having a wonderful day. In today's video, I'm going to be showing you our three-step process in how we get into position and how we get ready to play. Let's jump into it. Before we even talk about positions, one of the most important things that you need to learn is posture. Posture is going to help all band members play better because you get to use all the air in your diaphragm and it really helps expand your lungs so when you're breathing and when you're playing it makes it a lot easier first position is all about posture i like to sit up on the edge of my chair and my feet flat on the ground i have this little imaginary string at the top of my head and i pull it up and now i bring my shoulders back like i got an s on my chest now let's jump into first position what you want to do first is everything I said about posture. Feet flat on the ground, shoulders back, string, bring you all the way up. Now your instrument should be on your lap across your legs. Bells facing to the right. Eyes right at the director. I'm looking at you, Mr. G. And I ain't breaking. Nope. I'm just staring. And that's what I got to do. You snap into first position whenever I stand next to my podium, and I'll just look. Whenever you see that, you're gonna know, oh, Mr. G wants me in first position. And we do this every single day. For second position, I'm gonna pretty much stay in first position, eyes on the director, not breaking eye contact, and then I'm going to move my instrument onto my right knee. There are some instruments that are gonna have some troubles with this. Trombone players, your second position is gonna look just like this. Hey, that's pretty easy. Tuba players, your first position is right here. Your second position is right here. You're gonna stay the same. For all my saxophone players, you're gonna keep your instrument on your right knee with your fingers on the keys. Whenever you move to second position, you're gonna move your instrument to your right knee and just keep your fingers on your keys. Once I call for first position, I check to make sure everybody is doing it. If everybody isn't doing it, I can't go on. Um, thank you. Once everybody's at first position, then I move on the podium, and that calls for second position. Once everybody's in second position, I put my hands up, and then we get ready to play, and that is third position. But Mr. G, what about the percussionists? Huh? The percussion are gonna be the cool people. For first and second position, they're just gonna have their sticks together right in front of them. And whenever the director gets into third position, they're going to get into playing position like normal. <laughs> Boom. Another thing I need you guys to remember is when we're at the end of a performance, the director is going to keep their hands up for the ending. When I have my hands up, your horns are up. That's our, that, that's in the beginning and that's at the end of a performance. So when I'm going one, two, three, and off, the performance is not over yet. Not yet. Not yet. Now you can put your horns down. Well guys, I hope this video is really helpful. Remember, in a performance, we not only have to sound good, but we also have to look good. A band that is uniformed in how they play and how they act is going to be the best band. All right, well, that's the end of the video. Thank you so much, and have a great day. Go Braves.